Here's a little PSA for the townies and city folk. Stop saying the farmers are going to be happy every goddamn time it rains. Because A, no we won't be. Because when are we? And B, when it rains, it has to rain with such scientific precision in order to sustain life. Not only by timing, but also by volume. So imagine, if you will, here we are, this year, after having had last year's insufferable drought. There's a chicken making noise over here, by the way. Several of them. Last year's insufferable drought. All the hay reserves, feedstock reserves, were used, depleted, they're gone. It's going to take decades to replenish that. Now imagine you just spent $1,000 on diesel in your tractor to mow a hay field. Because... You're looking at maybe a four day window where it's not supposed to, not forecasted to rain. So you go there, you knock the grass down. You can't bale it right away. It's gonna sit there and cure in the field for four or five, sometimes six days <clears throat> until it gets dry enough that you can bale it. And then what happens? All of a sudden, the Lord giveth, but he also taketh away. And you get a half an inch of rain. We talk about a million dollar rain in the spring right after you seed and if you get just enough rain after you seed but not too much and not too little you might actually get ahead but now imagine you've got crop laying there in the ground waiting to cure waiting to be baled and you get a half an inch of rain on it and you've got no feedstock left in the yard things are going to look tough this fall i tell you